Okay, there we go. So now we're recording. Uh, yeah. 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 Uh, sad dude. Uh, the sad dude. Yeah, the sad dude. Uh, right next to me is Faze Elgo. Like, comment, and subscribe on all of his video. All of his video? <laughs> Check him out. His link will be in the description. And, uh, if you just clicked on this video randomly, then you would not know by the title. This is a video of the time I got chased in a car. Far away from my house. Over in the big city place. Uh, yeah, so, a little while ago, uh, I was with my friend, he brought a lot of people over to his house for a sleepover, and the next day after sleepovering, I guess, uh, what happened was, we all decided to have the idea to go Nicky Nicky Nine during. Now, my friend had like three of his other friends over. And I went there with my friend, who was friends with the person who uh, was having the sleepover before he moved. So what ended up happening was uh, we all went Nicky Nicky Nine doing, and one of my f okay, I need to stop saying friends and just give these people names. Okay. Jimmy, Bob, Joe. No, uh, I'll name like. Okay, Luna. <laughs> I'll give, like, like, I guess the badass person the name Randy. One of my uh, friend's friends. My friend who was having the sleepover, I'll call him Lucas. And his other friend, I'll call him Dylan. And my friend, I'll call him uh, Brady. So, uh, so, what happened was, uh, I forget the names already. Oh wait, no. Uh, Randy, uh, Nicky Nicky Nine doored the house first, and it was early in the morning. Don't forget. So what ended up happening was, after hitting the house's door, we ran, and we heard something shouting. So us being dicks, we went back to the house again, and my friend Randy didn't want to Nicky the door again because he already did. So, me, I went over and did it, but when I went over there, I forgot that it was really early in the morning, so I heard crying uh, inside the house. Turns out we woke up the fucking guy's baby, and I'm guessing that's why he was extremely pissed, because this baby wasn't just like crying, like this baby was flipping, like hard. So, what ended up happening was me not wanting to really be that much of a dick. I uh, didn't knock on the door hard, but still hard enough that the, you could hear it. And I started to just walk from the house. And I look over at my friends, and I see them like just give me a scared shitless look and just start running in the other direction. And I heard, like, right next to my ear, the loudest scream I've ever heard, just scream, hey. I turn around and see this bald guy that looks like a biker. And he just, like, tries to grab me. Me, I just start running as fast as I can away. And I swear to God, this guy's magic because he just teleported into a car. And, no, like, it, he, it was like he jumped in, like, Saints Row style. <laughs> No, honest to God, he, like, went so fast in the car, it's not even funny. Like, me and my friends were laughing about it afterwards. We, he, like, basically jumped in. He left the baby alone, which is kind of weird, but still. Maybe, but who would want to be with that guy? He's a bald biker dude. Nobody likes those people. Like, finds where I live and, like, just, like... Kills you. No, like, drags me out in my sleep and, like, 
puts my head under his motorcycle tire and starts like doing a burn out of your dick. Yeah, right. Doing a burn out of my dick. Ah, oh, that'd be nasty. <laughs> sad dude so uh anyways after that we started being chased and all my friends went one way except brady brady went a different direction and i'm guessing this guy thought i was brady because he ran really not ran drove really fast and he was really close to hitting brady i swear to god he tried to hit him he was also like halfway out of his window like screaming Adam, my friend like tuck and rolled, Brady tuck and rolled basically, get away from the dude. What? Who's talking? That was, that was my headphones, my headphones talk. But uh, yeah, uh, Brady basically tuck and rolled out of the way and the guy goes to turn around and me because he basically almost hit my friend. I start screaming at him, and I'm guessing then he realized that I was the one that was banging on his door, cause he like just left my friend alone and started to zoom up the road towards me. So I run and I go behind a house with my other friends, and me not wanting to get stuck with like those pine needles from trees, I go out in view of the road. Which is stupid because the guy saw me and quickly turned around. Uh, Brady was like, he disappeared somewhere behind a giant store because he was in the parking lot when the guy was trying to hit him. And, uh. So, we were running from the car. And. My friend that, uh. Lucas? Yeah, Lucas had over. Huh? My friend that Lucas, like the one who it was his birthday, had over, he, uh, Dylan I'm talking about, Dylan, my friend, what? Something weird just happened. You said at the start that he was having a sleepover party because... It was his birthday. You said it because he was moving. Oh, did I? Yeah. No, I said he moved. Okay, so what happened, my friend moved, and me and Brady were his friends before he moved, and then he moved and got two other friends, Dylan and Randy, uh, Lucas is the friend that moved, uh, Dylan, he was the slowest out of the group, like, in the head? <laughs> no, like, he was just really slow, so when we were being chased by the car, was he bad? you know the Pokemon, uh, maybe, uh, you know the Pokemon Slowpoke? Like the really slow one, like slow in the head and slow in the bed. No, slow in the head and, <laughs> s and slow in the bed and is just really slow moving all together. Well, uh, picture Dylan as the one that a Slowpoke, and me, Lucas, and Mandy are uh, the Sonic the Hedgehogs. So we're just zooming down the road, like, into a giant place where there's a bunch of stores. And the guy's trying to beat us, but he has to go all the way around to a stoplight and stuff. So we had enough time to uh, run and try and find Brady before, before the guy could find us again. And my friend Dylan, who's basically a slowpoke, uh... You know, but you don't want to be mean. True. Uh, <laughs> he, uh... He basically... Was, like, running his fastest. But that's basically the same as, like, a slug jogging. So he was just, like... Kept looking behind him, scared shitless that the guy was gonna try and run him over. But the guy was more interested in me, so he just zoomed by. So, what happened was, we found uh, Brady, and 
for like an hour or so. We just hid under like a giant truck. I'm not sure how long. Not an hour, like... I don't know. Ten minutes, it felt like an hour. Uh, we were hiding under like a giant truck. And... We could just see the guy go up and down the road until finally he, uh... Went back into his house. And we waited like a couple minutes after we went into his house. But he, uh... And then we went over to my friend's, uh... Porch, I guess? And we were there, and I wanted to be a dick, so I... Asked if we could go back over and, uh... Knock on his door again. <laughs> no, we did, later, when it was night. We went over and banged on his door. <laughs> he came out, I'm pretty sure he was watching us. I hope it was him, because I gave the finger to someone, and I think it was him. But, uh... Yeah, that happened. And I think he called the cops shortly after, because we started hearing, uh... Sirens. I think he was looking at us. Because I could see someone up the road. So I was laughing. And we went back in. And the cops went by my friend's house a couple times. And then we, uh... Yeah, that's basically the story about the time. My friend almost got ran over. And cops were called. And we had to stay inside for the rest of the day. Except for when we went back outside at night and started banging on his door again. <laughs> so, yeah, that's the story. Shit story. Shit story? Well, if people want to go over to your channel, they can look at a different story. If you're making one, are you going to make a story on your channel? You got good stories, though. You got funny as hell stories. Yeah, but I'm gay. I'm gay. I know you are. Comment on uh, all of... Faze Elgo's vids. Elgo with an E, an L, and an G, and an L. <laughs> but yeah, now we're just kind of sitting here in silence. So, yeah, that was the story of the time that, like, my friend almost got ran over. By a deal. Walking home from my house Christmas Eve. What? Oh, just start off the video like that. Walking home from my house, Christmas Eve. My friend got ran over by a reindeer. Clickbait. <laughs> Clickbait. Alright, so, yeah. That's the end of the video, bud. See yous. Love yous. Like, comment, subscribe to Maddie Mac. 420, blaze it. And, uh, go over and, uh, don't check out Nuketown. Yeah, check out FaZe Elgo. Don't. Trick Shots in Nuketown. Don't. Uh, his most famous vid. Hitting him, uh, Tomahawks. All zero them of them? Th yeah, definitely. Them window shots. Damn. The rest of this is just basically self advertisement. I'm sorry. Mm. I love you guys, and that's it. You love your 22. Have a good time, and don't get vaped. That's all I have to say. I'm gonna leave you. <laughs> okay. Facade.